Hi everyone! So I'm here today to do a everything video. <laughs> um, I have a lot of things to share with you um, and it's not going to be just one specific thing but um, it's sort of like a haul video, show and tell, and a current love so yeah. I don't really have a really clear title for this video yet. I'm probably just gonna say like an everything video, I'm not so sure. But anyways, um, first thing I wanted to show you is my new haircut. So this is what it looks like. Um, I ended up getting a pixie bang because I saw this picture of Christina Aguilera one of my stylists to emulate it perfectly, but she discouraged me from getting it. So this is kind of like my own unique or her unique take on a pixie bang, uh, which I'm loving. I just love it so much. It's just so cute. And, um, I am having so much fun with it. So, um, the next thing I want to share with you, aside from that, from my haircut, that's my show and tell, is a current love for the month of December, and it is a Satsuma um, body butter from the Body Shop. And um, it's winter time here, so it's much colder or whatever, and um, I need the extra moisture. I've just been like exfoliating a lot with um, my Buffy. Um, that's another current love is my Buffy. Um, body bar from Lush. It is awesome. It's super moisturizing, but to lock in more of that moisture, I'm using the body butter. And I think I love it so much, not only because it's a very thick, heavy body butter. I'm sure like if anybody's used the body butter from the body shop, you know, it's very thick. I mean, it just does not come out. Um, but the smell is so intoxicating. It's absolutely lovely. I just love this stuff. And it layers really well with my Versace Bright Crystal perfume. So I am so loving the combination of the Bright Crystal with this. And I know it sounds really weird, but they have like these nice fruity tones to them. So um, they work very, very well. And I'm loving this product. I just love it. And I, I bought the little one thinking I wouldn't like it so much, but I think I'm going to have to ask for the large one for my birthday. Okay, so the next thing is a haul. Um, it's a very small drugstore haul that I purchased. A drugstore slash Target. Um, the first thing I picked up was the Lust palette from Wet n Wild. And you guys know how much I love my vanity palette from Wet n Wild. And I picked up the Pride palette about two weeks ago. And I ended up going to Target and I found the Lust palette. And I loved it. Um, I lusted after it, actually. Um, because I saw a video uh, that Vintage or Tacky did, um, that's Cora. Check her out, she's awesome on YouTube, she's just so much fun, I love watching her. But she's got great tutorials, and she used um, this palette to create a day and evening purple smoky eye. And she uses, um, or she has a list of the MAC dupes from this palette. Um, and she says there's like a dupe, a MAC dupe for every single color in this palette. And she just thinks it's awesome. So I went ahead and I picked it up because I love purple eyeshadow as well. So I got that. And then um, I've really been wanting this product, but I could never find it for some reason at my Target. Like it's always unavailable or just out of stock. But I finally got my mitts on it and it's the Sonia Kashuk Large Crease Brush. It's one of the short handle brushes. I mean, it's, it's really small compared to like some other brushes or whatever. But it looks like this. It's like a dome-shaped brush. It's good for $5.99 at Target. Um, I believe that price is pretty much the same everywhere. So it's $5.99. Really great purchase. The next thing I picked up was um, the Tresemme Dry Shampoo for Oily Straight or nor to Normal Hair. Looks like that. Now, y'all know that I love the Batiste one from Sally Hansen Beauty. But I didn't feel like going to Sally Hansen just because um, there's so much construction going on on the road that it's on here that I just didn't feel like going through all of that. So while I was um, running some errands and I was in Walgreens, um, I picked up this Tresemme, or not Walgreens, when I was in Target picking up the rest of my items, I picked this up and I've seen some hit and misses on YouTube here um, on this product, but... Um, I did use it once yesterday, and I'm not going to do a review on this product yet until I actually use it for at least the next three thing weeks. that I purchased um, is a brush, and I really wanted to get a, uh, a really nice one from Brush Labs or from Ulta. There's a brand that my stylist uses. It's called Cricut Hair Brushes. But again, I didn't feel like going down that road because it's like Christmas time, and it's just the traffic out there is just horrendous, and I just... I get a really bad ghetto mood whenever I'm in like traffic, so I just didn't feel like dealing with that. So I just picked up this brush. It's by Conair. 
and it's one of their tourmaline um, ionic ion brushes and I do have a Revlon ionic hair dryer and I would love to have like a tea. I picked up this brush I really like it because it's got a combination of like the boar bristle hair and it's not really boar bristle but they've got like that kind of bristle in there but also like the plastic one in there um, and I really like this I use it today on my hair and I think it did a really great job um, making it nice and straight and shiny it's way better than the other one that I had so um, I'm really liking this and it's got like that nice squishy jelly handle to it so it feels really good in the hand and the brush overall is very light so it doesn't feel really like um, heavy when I'm turning it or anything like that it doesn't make my arms tired so that's that um, I probably could have gone through that a little bit faster and instead of saying drugstore I should have said Target haul but that's where I got everything now for the really great stuff um, I purchased, well, I didn't purchase, but for my birthday, I really, really wanted some stuff from Chanel. Because I can't muster, I can't justify it myself buying it. Um, so I asked for it for Christmas. So my dad just took me to the mall and he was like, hey, what do you want? And I'll buy it for you. Um, thanks, Dad. I love you so much. Um, and my dad is just so great. Like, he, I'm sure everybody would say this about their dad or most people. But my dad is like so selfless and he would give you the shirt off of his back and he would make sure that like you are taken care of before he takes care of himself. And um, oh, all right, sorry about that little emotional thing going on there, but um, here we go. I'm gonna go on with my, um, my good haul. But anyways, I just wanted to say that out loud that I really do appreciate my dad. And um, I encourage for everybody to tell whomever you love that you appreciate them very much for everything that they do for you because I don't think that we say it enough. Um, so yeah. Whenever I go shopping though, I just want to let you know that I um, bring my own little tote. This one is from Estee Lauder and I got it as a free gift with purchase and um, I think it's so great to carry like a cute tote like this when you go shopping, especially when you go like buy like little things like from... Sephora or Ulta or whatever, or even the drugstore, like, I bring my own bag because I hate plastic bags. Like, I use plastic bags once in a while, and I'll, like, forget to bring my own bag, but I think it's just a little bit more um, eco-friendly to bring your own, and I think everyone should go ahead and designate their own little tote to go shopping with. Um, so anyways, I brought this with me when I went shopping um, with my dad, and um, we picked up he bought me the following items and please note that these are Christmas presents so um, it's not just because it's it's for the holidays so I really 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 wanted to buy the um, uh, to buy a really nice loose powder and so I ended up buying the um, natural finish loose powder in natural it's like number two looks like that and um, you get 30 grams which is about one ounce of product and um the testers look like little salt and pepper shakers are so cute but like when i put that product in my hand and i like kind of worked it into my skin it is the most silky feeling um powder ever and it's just so i mean look, look at all that product i am so excited to use this um this is my first chanel makeup item ever so i'm really really excited um it comes with a little puff which is really great, I think. Um, probably would have to wash it very often, or you can just use like a regular powder brush for this, but I might just keep this in a little baggie in my um, storage bin. I can tell that it's definitely worth the price. So I, my mom, my mom, my dad picked that up for me. And yes, I do love my mom too, but she won't be here until my birthday. Um, the other Chanel item that I picked up was the Matte Lumiere foundation, and I am soft honey. And it's um, a long-lasting soft matte makeup. It's supposed to have like a nice natural finish. It looks like. Um, and yeah, did I say that I'm soft honey? That's the that's the color. Um, he he tried two colors on me, and like one was way too light, and one was like kind of close, but it was like so it looked ashy to me, and I was like, you know, this kind of looks ashy. He's like, no, I think it's a good color. I was like, can you just try a third one just so I can feel comfortable with this color? And so he tried soft honey and it just disappeared on my skin. So this is like the perfect color for me. But come summertime, it probably won't be my color anymore. But I think this would be perfect. And I'm really excited to have a Chanel foundation. And it smelled really good too. So that was a great thing. All right. And then I got some samples from, from Chanel. I got the eye makeup remover. 
little blue thing here. This might go in my little travel bag if and when I do decide to go traveling. <laughs> and then um, he gave me the in Inimitable Intense Mascara. Uh, it's volume length curl and separation mascara. It's like a little sample. Oh, how cute is that? Oh my god. That is so cute. Let me try to open it. So I can show you the wand. Oh, I don't know which way the wand's going. Okay, so it's a rubber bristle brush. So it looks like that. It's a, it's a medium size brush. Look. And then I got the um, Glossomer lip gloss in number four, Spark. That is such a pretty color. Let's watch that. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. It's like a berry with a gold tone in there. It's like a gold sparkle in there. Oh, it's so pretty. Cannot wait to use this. All right, so that's enough for the Chanel. And then I was like, okay, I'm done. And then I decided to go to MAC because there was two eyeshadows that I really, 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 really wanted um, that I have been just, you know, dying after. Um, the first one is Aquadisiac. And it looks like this. I think it's like the perfect turquoise color ever. It's a little bit more light than you know turquoise but I love it and this is a luster finish that's what it looks like how pretty is that so can I wait to use eye catching and I think that will look really great um and then I got satin taupe which a lot of people know about it's frost I'll just swatch it oh, that, oh it feels so soft that's satin taupe so I picked that up I really liked it. I was going to get Wedge, but I was like, eh, I already have a ton of like matte brown, so I really don't need another one. Um, so I ended up going with um, Satin Toke. It's so different. It's so multi-dimensional. Okay, and then I picked up one last thing. I picked up the 266 brush. Like that. It's a teeny weeny brush. This is super fine. It's a lot more narrow than other brushes that I have, so I'm really excited to use this. So I will wash this along with my Sonia Kashuk one and let you know what I think of it. So yeah, that is my collective um, show and tell, current love, Target haul, and early Christmas present so, um, for my father. And a little uh, weepy weep for me. I don't know why I'm so emotional. But anyways, um, that is it. And I will be filming um, some other videos on my vacation for y'all. So um, I'll see you guys in the next video. All right, take care. Bye.